moving forward a dozen for the Catalan expects seven furlongs to trip again the length of the straight side the lower bend and they're off and racing so away we go Marie's Diamond it is who's immediately pushed into the lead from its second Duke of Hazard and glorious journey up on the outside also moving forward Pierre Lapin charting a wider course kept away from the others in the early strides but making ground up on the outside of the field so Marie's Diamond with glorious journey moving alongside Pierre Lapin continuing to press forward as they take the beginning of the bend in fourth place, safe voyage, nice spot on the rails, just ahead of history writer, then Duke of Hazard Escobar. So Lancelot comes next, just ahead of Space Blues in the all blue jacket. And then a couple of lengths back to Glania, who is towards the tail in company with Dubai. So Marie's Diamond and Glorious Journey make the little turn, will bring them on the straight and narrow and reach the halfway stage. Pierre Lapin on the outside of safe voyage, then history writer, Duke of Hazard towards the inside in the pink colours, travelling strongly. Escobar comes next from Sir Lancelot, then behind these we have Space Blues. And Grania is still towards the back of the field as well. So making their way now inside the final couple of furlongs. And out in front, Marie's Diamond from Glorious Journey. Safe voyage on the inside of History Writer. Pierre Lapin is now uh, passed by Escobar. Space Blues beginning to unwind. Sir Lancelot with work to do. Out in front, Marie's Diamond. But quickly, Space Blues moves alongside for William Buick. Dubai, the other Godolphin runner, is staying on. But Space Blues has moved to the lead. Sir Lancelot getting going late in the day. But Space Blues from Duke of Hazard. Then behind these Escobar and Sir Lancelot. And it's Space Blues, a comfortable winner of...